Nesbitt, how about your prejudices? You admitted to several at the beginning. Well, as I told you before, we have also our own prejudices against the African Negroes. We consider them as inferior. We have, of course, our own reasons for saying so. Well, what are they, Nesbitt? Well, first thing, we consider ourselves to be of the lost tribe of Israel and not Negroes. It's only that our uh, fists are burned that we look uh, like Negroes. And also, <laughs> we, uh, we've been uh, ruling part of Africa for, some, for hundreds of years uh, during uh, the 16th century, and uh, we ruled part of Egypt, Sudan, and as uh, far down as uh, Mozambique. Well, what about your prejudices against white men? Well, back home, if a woman marries a white man, she's considered mean. And when she dies, uh, the uh, priests never uh, pray for her as they would do for any ordinary man. It's just considered as suicide. Why do you think they look down on the white people so much? Well, for the first reason, uh, religiously they consider them unclean in heart because they eat pork, and that's uh, uh, prohibited in uh, religion. I'm from Ethiopia. <laughs> I think it's far time, it's high time, Ethiopians come to the side where exactly they are. I usually wonder, are you Negroes? You are not Negroes. You say you are not Negroes. Are you white? You're not white. <laughs> what are you? Well, I told you the answer. We are not Negroes. We are one of the lost tribes of Israel. It's just because our faces are burned yes, that we, yes. are, uh, we look like Negroes. I've got the point, you are lost. I think that makes a conclusive answer. <laughs> <laughs>